Hey guys, welcome back to J is for Justice. Quick update on the Idaho 4 case and Brian Koberger's court hearing from last week. We have an article from the Independent UK. Prosecutor Bill Thompson says that lives in Moscow could be in danger. Let's get into it. As I said, this is according to the Independent UK. The headline says Brian Koberger's attorneys warn people's lives may be in danger in the Idaho murders trial. Brian Koberger's attorney, Ann Taylor, filed a motion with the prosecution on April 4th requesting that discovery requests be placed under seal because, quote, the documents contain facts or statements that might threaten or endanger the life or safety of individuals. The motion warns that the full release of discovery would constitute an unwarranted invasion of personal privacy. In response to Ms. Taylor's motion, the state said the release of discovery could, quote, disclose the identity of a confidential source. It was unclear, they say, who the evidence may endanger or who the possible confidential sources in the case may be. And this comes after we watched this last week where both parties returned to court where they argued over the defense contacting the Lataw County residents to determine whether the jury pool could be biased. In a further hearing about the issue on Wednesday, Lataw County Prosecutor Bill Thompson questioned the defense's expert, pointing out that the survey was, quote, loaded questions and some are factually incorrect. Prosecutors also appeared to pour cold water on speculation about Mr. Koberger's connection to some of the victims. Mr. Thompson, this was a shocker, just blurted out in court, quote, it's false that Brian Koberger allegedly stalked one of the victims. You know that. He added that the expert should not, quote, go around screwing the knowledge that prospective jurors may have or not have. Mr. Thompson also said that the survey questions violated gag orders in the case and possible jurors were, quote, injected with information. He also added that the survey cannot stand. Judge Judge took that seriously. He said it was a total shock to him because this is a big deal, he says, and I take it very, very seriously. I was surprised that this was happening behind our backs. So at any rate, we don't know yet if the survey will continue or not because the judge, big surprise, didn't make a decision in the hearing. And we haven't heard yet if he is going to allow them to continue polling the surrounding counties or if he's going to put the kibosh on it. We'll see what happens next in this mess. Justice for the Idaho Four. I'll see you guys in the next one. Be sure to check out my other videos and playlists for more true crime content. And if that's not enough, you can join our Patreon. Don't have a tinfoil hat? It's okay. We'll make you one. It's that easy. See you guys in the next video. See you later. Bye.